Hi everyone, welcome to Gnan Cloud Garage. In this session, I'm going to talk about how to validate the newly added GPU from the HPE ILO. ILO means integrated lights out. This ILO is helpful to manage the HPE servers remotely. So let me uh, quickly switch over to our lab system to log into the HPE ILO. Let's say, let me open the HPE ILO. Okay, so once we log into the ILO console, so ILO console is loading. The initial page, uh, starting page, it is showing as ILO overview page. In the left pan, you can look for your system information. When you select the system information, we can see the system summary processor information, memory information, network information. When we plan to verify the GPU graphics processing unit, we have to choose the option is under system information, right pan, you can look for device inventory. And under device inventory, you can look for a PCI, sl PCI slots, peripheral component interconnect. So when we see the peripheral PCI slots, the PCI slots connected with NVIDIA AI 40 GB memory, and another one is PCI slot 5 also connected with NVIDIA. Suppose if I sell, drop the sort out with the product name, you can see the product name. These two slots are connected with NVIDIA A10 cards with 40 GB memory and other PC slots connected with a HP cards. OK. So this is how we can validate. But sometime currently this two device status is enabled state. Even though if you newly added GPU, some scenario under device inventory, if you feel it is not detected from this device inventory, what we can do is we have to restart the server. So restart is like, like a select the power reset. This is one method. And another method is in the left side, you can look for a power and thermal option. Under the server power tab also, we have a direct reset option. OK, that is second method. And third method is open the remote console. Even when you launch the remote console also here from the remote console power reset option. So any of the method we can reset once the reset is completed, come to the system information and right side go to the device inventory under device inventory. We can look for the PCS slots. We can identify the NVIDIA drivers information and also the NVIDIA GPU card details. OK, so hope you understand this point. Let's switch back so that that's it. Thank you. If you're watching this video first time, please do view, like, share and subscribe to the Gnan Cloud Carry channel. If you're already subscribed, I appreciate all your support. Bye for now.